for 18. Just noticed I think we can do some uh, training. Um, let's get Abraham. Let's get... <laughs> I can't do that Milson, that sucks. Let's get Adams. Let's give him some attacking scenarios. Let's get in... I think we need to do Martinez. Let's get in Odegaard. Let's get in... Like, you know, 
I'm saying is if you think that's utter crap, don't judge people by your own standards. Uh, you know, it's nice to get recognition. It's nice to, you know, play an event like that. Sure, it's not going to go how you want, but you know, you have to be proud that you got to that point. You know, and I think maybe Carriers won't probably ever make it to that again. Uh, you know, I don't know a team who probably will take him on now. Oh, that was so close to being an absolute belter. Let's see how close that was. This is a good angle, I think. That was real close. Um, so yeah, I uh, said so this was one on, wasn't it? Yeah, the first thing I remember. Um, That seems like, is that a pen or just a free kick? It's a free kick, I think. Where's Trent Alexander-Arnold when you need him, eh? Andrew Robertson. Um, how good is Bailey at taking free kicks? He's pretty decent, actually. I think he's pretty much the best we've got. Okay, well, it was on target, at least. Uh, have I scored a free kick? Oh, how did he stop that one? I do not know. That's it. That's a good tackle. I hope we injured him. <laughs> I can say that because he's not real, he's computers, but oh, come on, ref. Oh, we actually did injure him. A nice one, Walcott. Oh dear, they actually had to substitute him. <laughs> Shit, we actually broke. They bring it on Mane, okay. That's the second drop ball in like two episodes. I swear I've never seen a drop ball in FIFA before. And I know they exist and stuff, but... Oh, <laughs> so close. So close. Slicing the defense open. interesting though next season like to see how uh, Liverpool come back kind of what happens uh, hopefully Mo Salah is going to be okay for the World Cup I'd love to see him at the World Cup um, uh, obviously Egypt would love to see him at the World Cup I think this is like Egypt's first World Cup or at least their first in a while anyway <laughs> look at Loftus-Cheek this is vintage Loftus-Cheek 
vintage bursting through the middle that's because I put them on the you know make sure you go forward he's been a fantastic player for Crystal Palace this season by the way I really hope we can sign him like permanently I don't think he's going to be in, uh, I think he's a really good player but I don't think he's quite good enough um, at the minute anyway for Chelsea and I think they probably will want to cash in on him I think we could probably like get him for about 20 million I think Chelsea would be happy with that um, I, I don't know I guess it depends on who their manager is what he's thinking and whether or not he even has a say in the uh, oh my god how did you miss Oh, Abraham. Um, and whether or not he even has a say in transfers, you know. But uh, I'd love to see him go there. I, I'm sure probably most Chelsea fans wouldn't want him to go. But I think the reality of the situation is the guy ain't probably going to get much of a game there. Like, it's kind of obvious Chelsea haven't got a lot of interest in bringing through young players. Like, they have all these young players and they just send them out alone. Oh my god, why did he do that? Did you actually see that? Why did he not just... What was he doing? Oh my god, I'm gonna watch that at the end. What an idiot. That should have been 2-1. I'm sorry. What an idiot. They tried to like... Fit, like, do a trick shot in. Here comes Loftus Cheek, man of the match. No, 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 no. Okay. Right, let's go. Let's go, Bailey. Oh, what a ball. <laughs> what a ball. What a ball. Couldn't miss that one, could he? Look at that. Absolutely slicing defence apart. Good run, though, from Adams. Now we're starting to uh, get in the groove a little bit. I think that little tactical adjustment worked pretty well for us getting um, Ruben higher up the pitch.
great cross though, wasn't it? What a cross. It's absolutely pinpointed on him. And it looks like we're going to be making our way to the Carabao Cup final again. Uh, we got to... Um, oh, I had an idea. I can't remember if I said it last time. But I thought if I make it to um, a major final, I'm not counting the Carabao Cup as major, but I'm counting maybe the Champions League or FA Cup or even like an end of season like big match or something. I thought it might be fun to actually live stream it. Like that would might be quite cool. Um, because then like firstly, you know, there's no shenanigans going on where I'm just like reloading it. Not that there is anyway, because trust me, I really can't be bothered to do that. If I was going to do that, I would have done that when I brought a bloody, paid 20 million for a bloody, uh, um, 78, you know. Ooh, unlucky. Unlucky, Milo. Yeah, Klopp's bringing on, uh, someone. I don't think it's going to make a lot of difference, to be honest, Jürgen. Your boys have taken one hell of a beating. Loftus cheek with that hat trick. <laughs> See how nonchalantly he just smashed that into the corner. Legend. What a great match he's had. I kind of regret not using him more. Like I think in that attacking role he's really good. But just nonchalantly smashes it in the corner. Hard well on Ruben. Liverpool, you took one here, love a beat. I think this, to be fair, let's have a look, but I think this is not Liverpool's first team I'm playing here. If you're wondering why I'm beating them so easily. Uh, Aka, Benric, Cedric, Mane, uh, Salah, Firmino, Paletto. They got Gigi Wijnaldum in central defence. Yeah, I could argue this is probably not like a Ruben Loftus G10. <laughs> he just hasn't put a foot wrong, has he? Um, I could argue this might not be there. First team, you know. Oh, I thought I'd have the pace there to get through. Not quite, not quite. Broad Jurgen. Go. 
Loftus Cheek, legend. I want to see that miss actually. Um, after we went two 0 up. Ah uh, oh, no, they don't have any of their highlights. It's weird. When did we hit the post? Oh yeah, I remember when he should literally have like scored. Anyway, uh, well done, Loftus Cheek. Ten, a rating of ten. You can't really do any better than that. Like you literally can't do any better than that. Uh, cool. So we're gonna face Spurs in the final. That's cool. Oh, we got Birmingham next. Oh, we don't want to do this. Uh, okay. Okay, yeah, no, I didn't want to sell Jeffrey Schlub anyway. He's useful, he's a backup left back to be fair. Just have interest, is there anybody on loan who we could uh, have an interest in? I think most of the time these guys are going to be like just youngsters who are not really going to be of much use to us. I don't really know what we want anyway, so. We don't really want a 23 year old from Brentford. It's probably not the, the best. Let's go. As if Burnley would spend 18 million on a player. <laughs> I seriously doubt that. Yep, that's fine. He can have a pre-agreement with whomever he wants. That's an offer of Andy Carroll. They want to pay seven million. Absolutely. Uh, I will. I will take that. Yes. Um, <laughs> good God, you crazy bastards that want to pay seven million for Andy Carroll. I was thinking of um, having a look at some. Trying to maybe sign some freeze. Let's give him um, 40 and 400,000. I know this is weird because I'm saying I'm not going to play for the end of the season, but I thought, well, like, I should probably plan just in case I change my mind, to be fair. Because uh, I think there was some.
Search is Sampa. I don't really think I need a 77 rated midfielder. We've got some good. Oh, I need an, eight, an 84 rated midfielder, would be good. Um, so, uh, and Guidetti would actually be pretty good, I think. I'll sign him. Accept that, yeah. Uh, don't need a release cause. Um, let's give him 33,000 signing on bonus of 200,000. Let's try that. Submit. 36,000, yep, yeah, sure. Oh, they're saying that's all we can afford. Okay. Let's bring that down to like 400,000 and then let's bring that up to 33, let's say 25. Let's say, Phil, you can only afford 30. Okay. Let's try and give him like a big bonus. That's why. Uh. Okay. Okay, well, we know we could sign him potentially. If we sell Carol, we'll have a bit more money. Um. And slap. Slapped a goal. He's leaving as well. Transfer offer for Theo Walcott. Ooh, you know what? I might try and cash in on that. I'm just thinking, no, I haven't really got another right winger. Um, he's not getting any younger, though, is he? Um, I could probably pay like Sherla or Bailey, I could play. I'll accept that. Oh dear, did transfer window end? Oh well, maybe they'll go at the end of the season, that would be that would be pretty useful. Um okay. I'm not gonna play Loftus cheap because uh he's been that good. Let's get Martinez back up front, obviously at Milson still out injured. <laughs> Just such a brilliant uh, result for us, wasn't it? Um, yeah, save that. Okay, let's let's play Birmingham away. This is the FA Cup, right? This is the FA Cup. Yeah, I was gonna say I'm assuming Birmingham aren't in the Premier League, but that actually could happen. So. Certainly not next year, but they're a big enough team. It kind of a, a team which should be. What, what a goal! Okay, so we should be beating Birmingham really in the FA Cup final. Oh, how did he get that? 
we saw with these Birmingham players, they're like Incredible Hulk or something. Jeez Louise. Jota. I remember him. Oh man, that was not the pass I wanted. To be fair, that was not the pass he wanted there. So, I guess we're both even there. I felt like we maybe could have got something out of that. And maybe a penalty, but yeah. Okay. Let's work our way up there. I don't know if you can hear that announcer. It's the announcer just when we've had a pair of car keys handed in at reception. <laughs> it's kind of hilarious. It's actually hilarious how many people lose things and how many in times. Like, I mean, sure, my cinema has a lot of customers each week, but I swear to God, we have like at least four or five mobile phones a week, like handed in, where people have forgotten them. I don't understand that concept where you don't check your phone. The first thing you do is like check your phone once the film finishes. <clears throat> check it. like Ruben Loftus-Cheek-esque when in Birmingham get like a cage around their stadium that was well worked I think look at this kaboom that's like Loftus-Cheek all over again Van Ginkle okay so maybe it's not going to be 1-0 to Birmingham because once you get that breakthrough against they have to come out a bit more and when they come out a bit more that's when we we prosper either that or they score it's a bad pass told you <laughs> just counter attacking that's my thing that's my thing 
that's good good counter attack though. Sometimes I I've too many times I've tried to pass it there and not scored. So now I'm just like, you know what, if you're inside the eighteen yard box, just shoot. Too many times I try and pass did I get like the perfect shot, but it's like, you know what, there's no such thing as the perfect shot. We should make it into the next round of the FA Cup. It'd be nice to maybe win the FA Cup. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, dear, oh, dear. No one really win the league last season when uh, Walcott was there. Well, they did win the Golden Boot, to be fair. Oh, 
Theo. Theo, Theo, Theo. What could have been, eh? What could have been? Ooh. The keeper's made a few saves today, to be fair. He's done alright. Oh god. It's a melee. To kind of stretch the play a little bit. in the last probably couple of seasons he's not quite as dynamic as he once was no, I wanted to try and get that down to Theo but he didn't want me to do that apparently <laughs> tackled our own player oh god I can see that one nice like loop I was going to say, should have had it anyway. Even if the guy was on side. Luckily, he's, he's the guy who's full of beans.
Okay, well, solid 2 0 win. Uh, I'm intrigued to know how many we. Yeah, we had 10 shots on target. We had managed to score 2. That's kind of ridiculous. Liverpool people had but 5 1, so maybe they were saving their, their uh, team for that. Uh, Andy Carroll sold. Okay, so Andy Carroll was sold, but perhaps no one else. Didn't give me any money for the transfer budget. That sucks. Still made 40 million profit. Okay, and we got Stoke in the league, so let's finish up with this Stoke game. Uh, I want to try and play my first team, I guess. I think, to be fair, I'd love to see deserves. Um, he deserves after the uh, uh, you know game before to get a run in. I think. Otherwise, I think that's pretty much our uh, best team. So let's play at home to Stoke again. Love the Stoke kit. Such a shame about their team going down. <laughs> uh, It's going to kind of pressure them, I think. Oh, what a ball. What a ball. Nah, that, where was the run there? Loftus. Oh, it wasn't Loftus cheek, actually, it was uh, Bailey, I think. Oh, you see the touch there. It was fantastic for Martinez. Just to like kind of clip it behind him. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Oh, right at the stoke from the first moment. This is good. Oh, Loftus. <laughs> Fuck. Uh. <laughs> the player just lay down. Oh. Uh. Look at this. Where the hell is there a like, right back? Oh. I probably should have come back with that. I stuck all over the place. There's this guy I wanted to buy Gabriel. But never did. Oh.
Oh. Oh, dear God. Shocking. I thought he was going to just slam that in. Nice one, Loftus. Played brilliantly so far. Martinez. <laughs> that is why we don't pass it, Martinez. Holy crap, that was uh, that was a stray one, wasn't it? That was a stray one. That was so bad, that pass. I actually checked for a second to see if I was hitting the right button. That was a little bit too close for comfort. save. That's a cracking save. I think I might just knock that on the way out, unfortunately. Didn't really have much choice the player. It's one of those ones where the player's just going for it. Oh, I like the fact that Loftus Cheek is getting into that area more. That's absolutely brilliant. That's exactly where I want him. That's where he was so effective that like first season, I think it was. Well, at least the first half of that first season, I think it kind of fell apart after that. That does not seem like that should be a yellow card, to be fair. So I think the players I have left from that first season are uh, Reed Ward. There. But, you know, like main players, Reed Ward, I guess, Loftus-Cheek. That's it. Otherwise, I've changed the squad pretty much. We've still got players like Jeffrey Schlub and, you know, guys like that, but... Ah, all day long. All day long. The thing is about Odegaard, he is actually left footed, so that's actually pretty sh shocking. <laughs> that's a pretty bad shot. Like, I don't really think his best position is wide right. I think it'd be much better as an attacking midfielder. I just don't have a position for him right now. Oh, shit. That's better. What a save, that deserved to be a goal, that was a really good play, I think. Um, maybe to him. Maybe not. That's on decor. Oh, I mean, 
Blažević, I guess, as well. He's another player I've had since the first. Ugh. Oh, that was uh, a little bit messy. Yeah, Milosevic I've had since the first days as well. Ah, read that one, didn't he? Like a book. just like totally ran alongside him like wait for the cutback for god's sake man this guy's pretty quick not as quick as my keeper look at this end-to-end -end football oh held it a bit too long there didn't i it's so stretched isn't it like it's literally there's like no midfield it's just attack and defense Oh, nicely cut out. This is the kind of football match I like. No mucking around with that passing malarkey. Just run from one end of the pitch to the other. Of referee. Uh, they want me to take off Odegaard. Okay, we'll do that. Why in F would I bring on uh, someone who isn't walk off room, though? That's the question, isn't it? Um, I guess take off Abraham, bring on Adams. Okay. He got yellow as well. I think I got this is the most yellows I've ever had in a match, and that's two. Well done, Ruben. That's it. I knew he had the pace there, Adam, as soon as I saw him. Oh, yes. As soon as I saw him get like level with that defender, I was like, release that pass and he will, he will score it. There, there, that was when I knew. I saw that run. I was like, boom. So he's getting his scoring boots back a little bit now. He was a little bit disappointed first half of the season, to be honest, after a good finish to last season. But um, he's doing a little bit better now. I think there's like a thunderstorm coming. Oh, I love like teasing the defenders like that. It's so much fun. <laughs> That's a terrible shot to call. I was like, uh, yeah, just curl it in. No, no. 
It's more kind of like just a pass back to the keeper. Ah, that pass. What happened to that guy? Oh, he's injured. I'm quite glad I didn't buy him now. What is it about Brazilian strikers getting injured, eh? Did they just bring on Sado Berry? You know, was that who it was? Because that would be hilarious. Good stuff. So he had one shot. Yeah, we battered them. It's difficult to score against these sides. I will say that much. Okay, well, we've got Fulham up next. Uh, six points clear at the top. Um, Martinez top goal scorer with Abraham second. How about assists? Abraham. That's good. Where's Bailey? Adams is on eight. Oh, Bailey hasn't scored for a while then. Uh, Adams on eight. Bailey's on seven, yeah. Okay, cool. Well, thank you so much for watching. Bit of a better uh, little run there than we've had in previous games, that's for sure. Um, Calendar-wise, what have we got? Interesting. <laughs> Play Liverpool again soon. Uh, so just some FA Cup matches, and then after that, so we'll play those three games next episode and then after that we'll have the first Champions League knockout round of 16 against Real Madrid followed by a Carabao Cup against Spurs followed by a league match against Spurs <laughs> and then the next Champions League interesting, very interesting well anyway thank you so much for watching guys it's been my pleasure and I'll see you soon, bye bye